Nika. Hey, congratulations, red carpet premiere of yes. Sound of Hope. How does it feel for being here tonight? Uh, it feels surreal. It's been a long journey to get here. We're almost at the finish line, and I'm just so excited. I'm seeing everyone. I haven't seen them in a while, so I'm like, oh, I hope people like it. I hope they like it. So, so what initially drew you that you want to be a part of this important project, this important story? Well, as soon as I read the script, um, I wanted to be a part of it. And then I let my mom read it. And this is actually my mom's story. She was a part of foster care for most of her childhood before she was fostered by a pastor and his wife. And so the similarities were so, you know, um, jawing that we were like, you have to do this film. And I'm like, okay, mom, it doesn't work like that in Hollywood, but let's just see. And it turns out, here I am, First Lady Donna Martin. Now, now, how nerve wracking is it the fact that you are representing someone, you know, who's alive and well today and very much in this room? Yes, my biggest concern was that First Lady Donna Martin liked what I was doing. So I talked with her a couple of times before we started filming. I saw videos. I tried to learn the dialect a little bit because I've never been to Possum Trot. So I had to come up with all of this mm. like within like less than three days because we were uh, we were going through some recasting. And so it was interesting. But after the film was shot, I felt good about it. And when I talked with her, she loved it. So I was I was satisfied. Now, what message should audiences take after watching Sound of Hope? The big message is God can use anyone from whatever background, whatever socioeconomic status, it does not matter. God has a way of showing up and especially in a small town in East Texas called Possum Trot. Mm. Like even the name Possum Trot, what is that? We don't know where it is on the map, but we know that there were a strong, there was a strong woman by the name of First Lady Donna Martin who convinced not only her husband, but her church community to rally around fostering some of the, the most hard to place kids in that, in that part of the uh, country. Well said, well said. Well, I, ho I certainly hope the Martins enjoyed the film tonight yes. and you have a lot of fun tonight, all right? I will. Thank you so much. Hey, thank you. Appreciate yes, thank you. It. Have thank a you. good one. Thank you.